Hey guys, I'm Chani and you're watching the Art of Science. Lava is super dangerous, but not so much in the context of fun science. Today, with these ingredients, we'll see how to make an extremely easy lava lamp that even you can do at home. Did you know that lava lamps were invented way back in the 1960s? The original lava lamps contained water and wax. The heat produced by the light bulb melted the wax and caused it to rise. The wax then falls back down as it cools. So how do these easy DIY lava lamps work? These work with some very basic science concept of density and hydrophobic properties. Oil is hydrophobic and so it doesn't mix with water. Oil is also less dense than water and therefore it floats on top of the water. The fizzy tablets that we use are like Alka Seltzer or Inu. Once they drop down to the bottom of the glass, they release carbon dioxide gas when mixed with water. Carbon dioxide is lighter than both water and oil. So what it does is it tries to escape in the form of bubbles and so they travel upwards to the surface. As soon as they reach the surface, they pop. Once CO2 escapes, what's left is the water with which the bubbles were formed. So what it does is it sinks back through the oil layer into the water layer. This happens over and over again until the tablet is completely dissolved and that's how we get this incredible lava lamp effect.